So I break the cotton swab from the horizontal line mark and then the tattoo liquid flows to another end. Once the end is fully soaked with the liquid, I use it. This rose red color is a reddish purplish color. It applies like a water tint. If you've used Korean lip tints, then you know what I'm talking about. It applies smoothly on lips. It's not looking patchy at all for now. It feels like water on lips. The color is pigmented and still natural at the same time. It is not sticky or slimy. It has a hybrid texture that is semi-matte. It does not have any smell, thank God. And it tastes really sweet. Red is an orangish reddish color. Now, as I apply these cotton swab lip tints on my lips, they feel really hydrating. But later on, when they dry down, they just cling onto the cracks of my lips and make it look like as if I'm bleeding. But the colors themselves are very pigmented and very natural at the same time. The red is a beautiful red color, you can see it. Nude is a very beautiful brown purplish color. It has the same exact texture like all the water tints and it feels really really wet on the lips. Pink is an orangish reddish color. You can see that. So now we're going to check if it transfers. So already I have these four colors on my hand. Let's see. It does not smudge us. Does it transfers? Let's check it over here. It does not transfer. So is it removable? Let's see. I'm going to try it over here. Yes, it does comes out on a wet wipe. But it leaves a stain. I will update you guys later on. Bye-bye. So it has been around three hours and I have been noticing ever since I applied it and it dried down. Even the stain, it's like, it's sitting in the cracks of my lips. It looks like as if my lips are bleeding or something. It doesn't look cute at all. And even when I drink, uh, a little bit of color comes off, but it doesn't bleed off the lips. So overall, I don't like it much. So I'm not going to recommend it because I prefer Korean lip tints over it. I'm not sure what I'm doing. I'm not sure what I'm doing.